What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Y walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we did quite a few things. You know, we revived a fossil here and there, did a few things, and now it is finally time for us to leave Ambrit Town and go to the next place. Now, before you do any of that stuff, you talk to this guy, and he's going to be looking at you. He's like, should I give you a, uh, an old rod? Yes. So here it is, guys. We get ourselves an old rod. This will eventually help us with, like, capturing some decent Pokemon and all that stuff. I don't know why you can't capture a, 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 a Magikarp right now. It's what it says in the handbook right here. Yeah. Okay, so it is time for us to move on into the next portion of our adventure right here on Route 8. And, uh, well, let's see. We're technically in Ambrett Town. And what we're going to be doing right here is that there is some items that you can grab... And yes, we can crack this. Again, guys, you can crack these rocks and get yourself some rare items or battle a Pokemon, just like this. It's kind of annoying, right? And look at this. We are taking on a Binacle. Binacle, I think that's how you pronounce it. And well, let's go with a Flame Charge. We do want to capture this Pokemon. So let's go with that. <coughs> Dang. Alrighty, the cough is coming soon. Let's go right ahead with the uh, Fury Swipes onto us. And that right there is not going to work out. Oh, yeah, it's not. It's definitely not going to work out. Yeah, three scratches and you're out. Okay. Let's see. If we go with the side Beam, it might defeat it. But we'll take a chance right here. And, well, I guess we were right. Yeah, we were definitely right about that one right there. So, let us move on. And let's grab this. Here we found ourselves a pearl, which many of you guys already know. You can use this to to uh, to buy or to actually sell for a higher price. So we're going to be going towards this other area right here. Route 8, M Murel. Murel Coaster. I can't even pronounce that. But yes, we're going to be uh, battling some trainers, grabbing some new stuff. As you guys can see right here, you'll find yourself a Mago Berry. And... Well, there's not a lot of stuff that you can find right here except just a whole bunch of sea. Look at that. A whole bunch of sea, shortcut, shores, everything, no seashells. And there... Okay, so I think there's a, I think there's a way to position yourself right there because I do see a person you can battle. Let's see. Right there? Right there? It's not there. Okay, so where would you battle this trainer? So I'm, I'm assuming that you get to battle them. Let's see. Yeah, I guess you get to battle them while you're surfing. I, I, I could be wrong, guys. So let's go and move on right here. And this lady's going to be like, that's a dowsing machine for you. With this, I can find items I can't see without trouble at all. Here, I have one for you. Use this as a treasure. And there you go, guys. We get ourselves a dowsing machine. And this will help us try and find some, uh, some hidden items that, well... You know, you guys already know. And let's see. There is a person. Well, there there are two people that you can battle here through through what was it called? Um Can't really I can't remember. Yes, through uh arrow 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 Pokemon, arrow fighting that I don't even know, arrow battles or something like that. Anywho, we're gonna be taking on a pretty later right here with the Wingle and uh let's go straight for a side beam attack right now. Look at that, Cybeam does the trick, and there goes our good old buddy, Wingle, and, well, let's see, we're going to be taking on a Psyduck, so let's give that chance to Nova right here, and, well, let's go right ahead and, uh, you know, yeah, we're going to be taking on, yeah, let's just give it, we're giving Nova... A bit of a chance right here against a Psyduck. So let's go straight for a Thundershock. And bam. Just like that. Just like that. We are almost defeating a Psyduck. And here comes a Water Pulse attack. So that right there is just going to mess us up. Oh my god. We are confused. We're going to... Yeah, we're going to try and be lucky and, uh, and hit this Pokemon. So... Damn it. Okay. So yeah. We... Yeah, we weren't lucky. We weren't lucky at all, so let's go right ahead and use Poping to get some revenge off this Pokemon right here. 
and we're breaking the mold. I still don't know what the break uh, the breakage of the mold would have to be. So let's go right ahead and let's go with a slash attack. Yeah, slash attack would actually work right here. So here we go, slash attack nearly defeats Psyduck. And that right there hits us pretty hard. Okay, so let's go right again. There it is. Slash attack, another one, and that is for the win. Look at that, okay. So, there we go. Jordan the Goat is actually getting himself another level, which is great. And... Well, we're gonna have to move on right here. Yeah, we're definitely gonna be moving on. Now, first is first. We're gonna revive our Pokemon because we kind of need everybody right here. And I don't... Yeah, I don't have anything that can revive this Pokemon. Good gravy. Okay, so... I'm gonna be right back with you guys. Okay, so we're back, and, uh, well, we're reviving... Well, well, we revived our Pokemon right here, and now it is time for us to take on another opponent right here. Another fisherman, and his name is Wharton, and he will be coming out with his tentacle, so... Yeah, we're gonna try... Yeah, we're gonna try our hardest to just beat this Pokemon. So, let's go straight for a Psybeam attack. For the win! Oh, yes. Funny thing, guys. So... As we're probably going to be seeing this walkthrough. Yeah, it's going to be what? Uh, 2024. Yes. And hopefully every single day in a row you're going to be seeing an episode of Pokemon Y. Probably because, you know, your boy right here wanted to try something new. And probably wanted to complete this walkthrough quickly because, you know, there, there, there are other walkthroughs that we need to complete. And, uh, well, let's see. As I'm currently recording this, it's, it's December 10th. What came about this idea? I do not know. Probably because, uh... Probably because... I think the goals have gotten higher. A little higher right here. I've been... I've been on YouTube for about 13 years. And... You know, it's been, it's, it's been doing pretty well as of late. I mean, I can thank the COVID, uh... I can thank COVID for that because, uh... What was it called, um... Yeah, I think we we're all cooped up at home, and then people started discovering that, yeah, your boy right here is playing some walkthroughs, so everybody started looking into my channel. So again, I thank every single one of you guys who uh, who, who subscribed to my channel, because I remember I was stuck at 6,000 subscribers for the longest time, and then bam, it just it exploded. So thank you guys, and th this is the reason to why we're continuing on. We made the investment with a whole bunch of other stuff, like, you know, Brand new computer, green screen, lighting, the whole shebang. Hmm. Yeah, we really want to make this thing uh, uh, work out. Especially when, I don't know, if the time comes, I am done. Yeah, we, we, we kind of want to, yeah, we kind of want to leave this in, in a good place right here. So, here we go with Thundershock. Mm-hmm. For the win. And there you go. Nova finally gets a victory and grows to level 19. And Poping, yes, definitely getting something. And Blade, growing to level 21. And here comes Staryu. Yeah, we're definitely not uh, switching our Pokemon right here. So we're gonna give we're gonna give a little love to Nova right here. And no, that yeah. You have got to love the whole swift attack right there. So let's try this again. Thundershock. And here comes Rapid Spin. Yeah. That was not effective. There was no binding or anything like that. And, well, there you go. Thundershock for the win. And, well, there we go. Shat or can't remember his name. Yeah. <laughs> he has been defeated. Okay. So let's see. It is starting to rain again. This could work out in my favor, probably. So, let's see. Let's go ahead and use a potion onto Nova right here. And... Well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and talk to this guy, or this chick right here. I'm getting tired of wearing this, uh, this swimsuit. I think I'll make uh, this my last battle in it. Ah, you don't say. Okay, alrighty. So, here we are taking on Swimmer Marissa. And she will be coming out with... Yeah, Masquerade right here. Now, I believe it will be a little bit faster. No, I was incorrect. It has Intimidate. 
So, let's see. Let's go with a charge attack right here. And here comes the quick attack. Oh, crud. That, yeah, that was a critical hit. So let's go ahead, charge it up just a little bit. And there we go, our special defense. And let's go straight for a Thundershock attack right here. Oh, my God. Come on. What is it with the quick attack? Here we go. This better work. And, oh, nearly defeats this Pokemon right here. Yeah, it's not going to work out right here because Masquerade is basically going to get, like, two attacks on me. So let's go straight to Jordan the Goat. And, well, let's see. Gust attack. It's, it's almost like it knew. Oh, my God. Okay, so let's go with Nature Power. And seriously? Oh, Lord. Almost defeats my Pokemon. So here we go, Earth Power. And it doesn't work on this Pokemon because technically we're going to be on a ground type. So let's go with Sharp Tooth. Let's see. Let's go with Sharp Tooth and uh, see what it can do right here. Here comes a Gust Attack. Not going to work. There we go, Sharp Tooth. Let's get it. Let's go with a Bite Attack. And oh, you gotta love the you gotta love these attacks. Not effective. Here comes the bite attack, and there you go. Masquerade has been defeated. Okay, alrighty, alrighty, and that will give us a lot of points and most of our Pokemon, you know, growing some levels and all that stuff. Okay, man, that was annoying. That was annoying. That actually says something about my Pokemon right now. So let's go right ahead and waste these potions. There we go, Nova getting the potion and giving this, giving that, and giving this. And let's not forget Sharp Tooth right here. Okay, so re I'm wasting the regular potions just because, you know, eventually Yeah, eventually we're gonna We're gonna be needing a bigger better potions, but I think if you go right here, you will be able to battle yourself a flying type trainer, but it has to be at a very specific spot. Let's see, probably here. Let's see. Here, here, here. Do I have a flying type Pokemon? I do not know. Here, here, here. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We're not going to battle anybody. That is pretty much it. There's nothing there except for Sign. And here we are, guys, in Silage City. And in the next episode, it is going to get a very interesting just because it. It is the home of the next gym badge. And, uh, well, quite a few interesting things that we can find here, too. So, keep an eye out for everything. Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being uh, supportive, as always. I'll be back for another episode of our Pokemon Y Walkthrough. See you guys.